intensity and, and how that translated to uh, and how that translated to results on the field. Uh, I think y'all seen what happened. I think um, they played physical all three phases and got the job done. Like Coach Campbell does bring that energy to the team, and you know, as we see, we played much better in the last first four weeks. And talk about the, the difference in practices, the intensities, the one-on-ones, and again, how that... I mean, I think practices, um, they're short, shorter than what they were, but they're more intense, and um, guys are bought in, and, um, you know, they work, and hopefully they keep working. What's the next step now for this team? Keep improving. Keep, you know, everything was perfect on Sunday, as long as we keep improving, and, you know, I think that's the biggest thing. We can't get content. Yeah, Dan said today that the uh, you guys are notorious for that. Like you'll have a win, a big win, and there's a lull. Uh, I don't think it's going to be a lull this time. I think guys believe in what Coach Campbell's doing. Uh, I think guys are way are way more in tune. I think guys believe now, and I think guys are going to prepare. Like you know, you can keep winning. That's what we're going to keep doing. Do you feel How like you the feel? pad level uh, throughout the, the duration of this contest for the offensive line, do you think that that's much improved? I mean, it, I think just coming off the ball, being aggressive and not thinking so much helpless. And just, you know, having our legs up on us, not having long reach and stuff like that. And, and guys just, you know, taking care of themselves more. Because we are, you know, I, I think guys realize we do have a good team. And, you know, and you know, I, I believe guys know where we can get it done. As a line, how much do you guys want to hit somebody else in the mouth and have that running game actually going? I mean, if, I know for me and, and, and you know for the other guys, you know, it was kind of disrespectful. People saying, you know, we can't get the run, run game going and people calling us out. So I, I know all of us wanted to get it done. We got it done. When how did you feel out there in your first game back? Uh. I felt better coming back this time than I did the Redskins game. Much better. I felt like more myself. Um, you know, I look at Mike Ponce every day, and I had to evaluate myself, and I see his professionalism, how he carries himself, and and I had to question myself, see if I'm doing everything, you know, just like him to, to even, and I'm so because I'm so far behind. I was like, I'm doing everything to get myself right, and I started doing more and more, and just uh, you know. Personally, I felt like I did a lot better this game. Very, very sore. I'm sorry, Josh. Very, very, very sore today, like, like when, when you first came back in the. No, no, no. no. Not as good. bad. Okay. Not as bad. You know, I started drinking a lot of water last night, took myself to bed, and woke up this morning and took care of myself, lift the weights, and got the sore and sore. How rewarding was not only the success of the running game, but the run pass pal balance? Much yeah, more balance. Want, I know I don't want to pass. I don't care how good of a pass blocker. I don't want to sit there and pass the ball, pass block 40 times. I'd rather have, have it. A balance attack, and it helps everybody. Like I said, keeps the defense on the field. Ryan doesn't have to be back there and taking hits because I don't care who you are, you're gonna get beat if you pass the ball 40 times. And um, you know, it helps everybody out, and, and it did.